All right, hello, and welcome to this very first playthrough of Cookie Cutter. We're going to start this video the way we start every initial video of a game I play, and I'm going to very briefly tell you what I already know about this game. And that's not going to take long. So I've got my How Long to Beat page pulled up here, uh, and I can see that this game came out five days ago. December 14th, 2023. And according to how long to beat, it is 12 and a half hours long if we hurry. That's main story only. Uh, that's based on just a couple of entries, so might not be super reliable. We'll see. Um, and I am aware that it is a 2D post-apocalyptic hand-drawn violent metroidvania but i only i only know that because of this uh i don't think i've seen any trailers for this game i i i remember hearing about it on one of my lists of like upcoming 2023 games like a long time ago and hearing that it looked interesting but um I don't know anything about the character's plot. I've never played this. I've never watched anyone play this. I don't think I've seen any trailers. So aside from what I'm seeing right here, that's pretty much all I know. So we're going in pretty fresh. We're playing this on the PS5. I'm going to keep track of the deaths below me. If um, we get... I'm going to try really hard not to get that first one. You never know. One of these days I'm going to get that no-death run. After that, we'll relax a little bit. Um, but we'll keep track of those directly hmm. below me. What is okay. the screaming? Oh, uh, it's probably going to be loud, so let's, uh, because the last game was really quiet. So yeah, let's turn that down just a bit. Okay. Uh, real quick, I just want to look at two things on the options. Are there subtitles? And, um, is there a performance mode? Uh, this is it? <clears throat> Alright. Alright, I like it. Empty slot. Yes, let's go. First, there was the void. And from the void came the matter. And like a cancer floating within nothingness, the megastructure. Many what? sought to discover its secrets, but all failed. All, that is, except for Victor Garbanzos. He led the Infonet Corporation deep into the heart of the megastructure and vanished. For years he was gone, presumed lost like all others. But one day Victor returned. He emerged from the heart of the megastructure with incredible knowledge, unbelievable technologies, and immeasurable power. To the astonishment of the people, he declared that the worthy would no longer fear death, that the Infonet Corporation would forever preserve their souls in immortal metallic bodies. Metallic bodies called Denzels. At his command, the Denzels built the magnificent Denzels? city, Mecca to the Chosen, epicenter to all the knowledge and the power of the megastructure. All that was 212 years ago. Holy shit. The Garbanzo's family and their Infonet Corporation still rule the megastructure today. No one knows what was found <clears throat> in the shadows centuries ago, or the true nature of the power that it gave. But the promised utopia was a lie. The Denzels aren't blissful, eternal vessels for devoted souls. They are the mechanized prisons of industrial slaves, bound forever to the will and whim of the noble corporation. Rebels fight against the tyranny, but their efforts are hopeless. Infonet's twisted armies are just too powerful. My name is Shinji Fallon. Once the engineer at Infonet, I was a part of their machine, and yes, I stood by as lives were destroyed, but no more. I will end this. My only hope is to know what they know. For that, I must follow in their footsteps and journey to the heart of the megastructure. I built my own Denzel, one beyond their control. I've manufactured Denzels before, but this one was different. This was creation, not construction. As the spark of her took hold, there was something. Something I didn't expect. Something I didn't even know that I was looking for. 
She... Cherry... Gave life to me. She... Is my happiness. We shared a beautiful life together. But we still planned to find the truth. We just never got the chance. Okay. Because one night... Infinite came for us. Oh, Christ. Oh, they didn't kill the human, though. Just the robot. So are we the human, or are we the robot? <clears throat> Looks like we might be the robot. Jesus Christ. Uh, oh. Wow, what an opening. Okay, 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 what are we doing here? Animation is highly disturbing. Okay, um, where are we going? Oh, hey, they haven't left yet. Salem Garbanzos. Really, Shinji? I'm glad they're talking. I don't have to read it. To you. Just let her be, Salem. You got me. Please give her back to me. I don't think so. Hey, the gates. The this kids. This abomination. It's time to go. Wait! Christ. <clears throat> um. It's a hell of a title card. Well, this game is already very unique, very interesting. It's violent like blasphemous, but in such a different way. <laughs> Good morning, kiddo. Wasn't sure if you were going to get out of bed today. Wait, what? How are we okay? Oof, yeah, gotta say. I felt better. You look better too. <laughs> you have the nightmares again? Nightmares? Ugh, don't want to talk about it. I'm going to take that as a yes. Jog loose any new memories about your primary function? Not even remotely. Ugh, half my life. I know it's confusing. Just give yourself some time. How about we talk about some good news instead? Okay. Yeah, I'm cool with that. Lay it on me. You should know already, Cherry. Can't you feel it? I surely can. Stress testing is complete, and I'm happy to report that your core structure is powered up and is firing on all cylinders. Cookie Cutter is fully active. Well, that's coming from inside me? Whoa, 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 down there. Hold up. You're saying I'm good to go? You better believe it. All systems are in the clear, girly. Finally time to bring Shinji back home. Hell yeah! Ugh, I've wasted enough time already. Let's freaking do this. 
Take care of yourself, Raz. I owe you one. When you're right, you're right. And you're right. <laughs> Listen, I know my timing ain't the best, but I'm gonna call in that favor now, if you don't mind. <laughs> you don't waste any time, do you? Okay, what you need? Ah, uh, you know, no big. Just a huge, ugly bug stole my backpack and fled underground. It's got all my tools in it. Those creepy suckers scared the shit out of me. Fine, you big oh. baby. Can you maybe I'll do me solid and retrieve it? For you. <laughs> I'll be back before you get hungry. Oh, that's hurtful. I'm working on me every day, but I'm gonna need those tools if you want me to work on you. Thanks. Glad we resolved this. Off you go. See you on the flip, girly. Okay, so we look very different. Is that how we looked before? That's not how we looked in the cutscene. I guess we have a, a new look. Uh, that's she's standing. Okay, so let me. Let, where's the map? Start to get to the map. Okay. Um, find Raz's backpack. Alright, let's see what we got for controls. I don't want to dream right now. Okay. This is a checkpoint. If you ever fall during battle, your body will be reconstructed at the last visited checkpoint. Convenient. <clears throat> I oh, just have to hit up and it saves. Okay, all right, got it. Yeah, yeah, I know. All right, what do we got for? So we have a a regular jump, uh, melee attacks from square. Triangle seems to activate some special ability that I don't have yet. Circle does nothing. L1 is a guard. L2 is a dash. I like that. L2 is dash and L1 is guard. That makes sense to me. Whoa! Holy shit. Okay. Um, Just goes back up. Right. Oh. Wait, what if I do this? Nah, I can't get up there. Oh, it's locked. It appears we will need to require the lost sexes key before we can gain access. Well, that's your smarts, doesn't it? <clears throat> okay, I'm not going to go down there yet because I'm going to go, well, let's go, let's go, let's go get the, can I get, can I, like, ledge grab? No. <clears throat> Components are systems upgrade that you can equip at Denzel stations after you collect them. Each component will provide you with a new skill or enhanced power that will greatly help you in your quest. You'll need a certain amount of energy to provide power to components. Energy cells can be found throughout the meta structure. Oh shit, I could have found the same one. Oh my god! You can find energy cells all over the mega structure. These will increase your energy you need to power components. Each energy cell you find will be automatically absorbed into your system and you'll be ready to use at a Denzel station. Wait. Edit components. Don't have any yet. 
You can find energy cells all over the mega structure. These will increase your energy. You need to power components. Each energy cell you'll find will be automatically absorbed. Yeah. So those tell you the same thing. Okay, that's a little bit weird. I'm already seeing a couple of weird yellow flags. Like some grammatical errors and some redundancies. Not a big deal necessarily, but... It's an indication of the production value. Although the actual animation is gorgeous. So, um, just not a complaint, just making an observation. Boy, it's locked. It appears we will need to... Okay, cool. Yeah, we know about that. So let's go back down here. Oh, so we can't go through this way. Okay, so we're gonna have to go that other way, I guess. Can you not jump and dash? You sure can't. How interesting. Maybe that's something you can unlock. Later on or something. Yeah, and you're not we're not getting up there. Okay. Can we, yeah, we, we can do like a ledge grab. Yeah, basically. Okay. <clears throat> oh yeah, it goes up pretty fast, doesn't it? Oh, he hit me. Motherfucker got me. Alright, well, hold on a minute, hold on a minute, hold on a minute. What am I picking up? Materials. Android scraps. An electro-titanium scrap for recycling. Seems useless garbage, but... Uh, seems like usage garbage, garbage, but perhaps in the hands of a professional, this electro titanium will shine once more. It's a, con it's a craftable. Weapons we have none. Components we have none. Abilities. Self healing. Hold down, and Cherry will use the power of the void to heal her body. Use self-healing. Yeah, it worked. This enemy just bought <clears throat> bits. It's a currency that can be exchanged all around the mega structure for bits. Don't be shy to defeat any potential threats. They can drop valuable materials that will likely be useful to you in the future. Okay. Oh, I see. You move the right stick to look down, look below you. Okay. Um, this looks like a checkpoint. Awesome. <clears throat> wait a minute, wait a minute. What's this? What was that? Nothing that important, I guess. Gauntlet. This powerful fist is able to change size with a blast of energy. Use it to beat the hell out of enemies. Ground attack combo. Triangle, triangle, triangle. Air punch and air triangle. Up, up and triangle. And does it cost... Use the gauntlet. 
Well, I don't want to put it away. Oh, okay. Okay, but it does use energy. Sherry, be careful. The gauntlet deals great damage, but also consumes void. Keep an eye on your void meter as you fight these conveniently dropped viewing robots. I'm just gonna charge it all the way up before I start using it. Now I can. You also finish enemies in glorious fashion when they're stunned. Once their HP is critical, just press the heavy attack button when near them for powerful finishes. Once their AP, HP is critical, does that not cost void? Because I don't want to spend void on an enemy I can kill in a regular way. It must be free. Otherwise it wouldn't make sense. I get to brutalize them? I'm gonna make it rain blood! Disturbing, but technically accurate. Brutalizing enemies will generate void spheres that will recover void in large amounts. Oh, that makes it worth it. Oh, whoops. Oh, god. Okay, cool. So far, so good. Uh, what? Oh, okay, I see. There's like a down attack. Oh, and you can juggle in the air. Okay, cool. Well, that's the way to do that then. Oh, fuck you. Yes. Just right. Here's a hint. Parryable attacks flash blue before enemy <coughs> can strike. A successful parry will deplete enemies of their grit, which is represented by their yellow bars. As their grit reaches zero, they will be stunned and susceptible to all of your violence. Be careful, however, because not all attacks are parryable. <laughs> Uh, do better. That's better. <clears throat> Get good at parrying at the beginning, please, Nick. You have such a bad habit of not parrying. Yeah, we figured that out already. What is this? God damn. Is there fall damage? Nope. Damn, this burger is TNT! Explosive as a nuke, addictive like a loot. There are two all mutant patties, atomic sauce, radioactive pickles, creamy mosquito pus, and a synthetic fluffy bun. 
Come to King Napalm, the king of nuclear taste. Are you brave enough? I am not. So with that interacting with that just gives us an ad for a disgusting cheeseburger. Yeah, we figured the map out. Thank you. Ow, you motherfucker. Goodness gracious! This looks like Raz's backpack. We mustn't waste time in returning it back to him. The backpack is so heavy and rusty it contains some useful, useful tools. Or, okay. Got it. Hmm. These are Shinji's logs. Unfortunately, they seem to be encrypted. Well, would you look at that? You found my backpack! I gotta be honest, I thought you were gonna die. I'm glad you didn't, though. Now, I've got a proper reward for you. So listen, this sector has two different accents. Take this here key to open the gates on either side, and you'll be able to explore the world beyond it. One last thing. If you find any components along the way, bring them back to me, and maybe I can upgrade them for you. Thanks, man. Although I find your lack of faith disturbing. There was no way those silly bugs were going to stop me. Yeah, I know, I know. You just got there and bring Sinji back. Ku key cutter. Obtain the lost sector key. Key opens the gates that separates the hidden diner from other sectors. Centuries ago, the hidden diner was visited by countless travelers from all over the world, but today it stands in ruins. Even so, it's home, and there's no place like home. <coughs> okay. All right, well, <clears throat> west or east? Yeah, we don't know what that is yet. Let's go west. There's something above the diner, I think. An item or something. The door has been unlocked, Cherry. Let's go. Discover zone the Denzel factory. Alright. I've been investigating this location on the net. It appears to be a Denzel factory abandoned by InfoNet due to an unspecified incident. Maybe we can find something useful in here. Or the Denzel factory. Alright, cool. We've got a whole zone. I like that. Okay, that doesn't seem to do anything. Oh, that just brings it back. I see, I see, I see. Atomic battery. What's that? This electro-titanium battery is the most important invention of the last century. It device, it, this device is able to recharge itself by drawing energy from the surrounding environment. 
we're probably still at least another 10 years away from that kind of technology, but I bet we do have it soon. 10 years might be a little over, over hopeful. Maybe 20. Maybe not, though. Alright, um... <clears throat> I'm gonna take this out because it's bothering me. Combat seems cool. It's it's a little bit different. Um it's it's interesting. This whole void system is is unique. I mean, it's it's. I've seen things like it, but I guess it's kind of like Hollow Knight because you have an energy source that you heal and use abilities from. But it's a little bit more incremental than that. We can't get through there. Noble President, with deep regret, I am obliged to inform you of the desperate situation linked to the production of new Denzels. Production is expected to drop by 72% by the end of this week. The remaining void particles will be used to power the development of the Nexus. Immediate action is needed to restore the stolen resources. I remain faithful to you as always and in the certainty that all our enemies will be destroyed. Respectfully, Otto M. Stein, Robotic Engineer, InfoNet Production Report, Year 212, Week 50. Okay. Oh, I see. Now I can go this way. Uh-oh. What's this? Oh, it's a shortcut. And the way the room widened out like that, it made it look to me like we were about to fight like a mini-boss or something. I guess not. Not yet. <clears throat> That's gonna really... A, lo a lot of how I feel about this game is gonna depend on that, too. That first boss fight. How is it gonna be? Is it gonna be fun? Is it gonna be bullshit? Metroidvanias fuck that up a lot. They get it right sometimes, too, but they fuck it up a lot. Okay, so don't jump in that, right? So if I jump, can I jump that? Don't forget you can parry. Okay, we need to get better at parrying. <laughs> It 
seems like some of their attacks I can't stun them out of. That's the best thing to parry. Who the fuck are you? Okay, dead end. Oh, well, maybe not. Uh... Should we go back that other way and see what's... I figured because that door was there, it would mean that that was the way forward. Now it's seeming like that may not be true. Okay, so that kind of stuff just shows up on the map, huh? I like that. Nice and simple. The hidden wall just showed on the map. Or the item behind the hidden wall, anyway, did. Is there a way to put indicators on the map? I guess it does it for you. What is this? Void bullet. You've always wanted to spit fire from your skull? Well, now you can! Press R1 to shoot a void bullet, capable of hitting distant enemies. Okay, so that's a, like a... an upgrade point. I'm glad I came back. Seems cool so far. I like it so far. We're gonna see, like, how far it goes with the, the the weapons and customization and stuff and upgrades and things like that. That's gonna have a lot to do with how much I like it. The boss fights will have a lot to do with it. The story, of course. Yeah, Perry. Get good at that parry. Oh, we need to try our new skill out, too. Ow, fucker. I don't know back up there, is there? Uh, I'll go back this way. God damn! That, uh, did a shitload of damage. It was expensive. But that did a shitload of damage. Alright, yeah, wait, wait a minute. I'm gonna go back. Is he? I thought I could still hear him. Maybe not. Ah, can't go this way yet. Okay.
Okay, what are you? It's a pipe. Okay, don't know what that is, but I can't reach that yet either. It seems to be in control of that door. Ah, shit. I should have done the finisher on him. Guy from Psychonauts? What's he doing here? Ooh, a checkpoint. Okay, nice, nice. Is this gonna be a boss fight? Oh dear, we're trapped, Cherry. We really should find a way out of this room. I am sensing immediate danger. So, is that like. Is that my vagina? That's what it looks like. It's flashing in that basic area, and just the design of it seems suggestive. Interesting choice. <clears throat> yeah, well, I'm sensing that it's time to have some fun. Most of that back. Boom, fucker. We got an atomic battery. Let's go. What's this going to be? What was it? Did you just give me some... Some scrap? Okay. Mall. We still have ways to go, apparently. Wait a minute. Uh oh. So I can teleport back to the diner from there? I don't have any components.
God damn, I need to I need to heal. Fucking I can't heal. Okay. I can't heal. Alright. Damn it. Okay, that's a death. That is a death. Fuck. Oh well. First death. I had to happen at some point. I mean, it didn't have to, but... I'm gonna save it. It was inevitable. These guys shooting. Shit, need to be stopped. figured the parry window out yet. I need to figure out the goddamn parry. Damn it, I was fucking. We need to figure that parry out. You guys can't jump, right? Don't do the parry unless you fucking need to. How about that? There you go. You seem to be better at it when you do it that way anyway. I'm really just trying to get better at the parry. 
Um, I'm not very good at it yet. The window seems weird to me. It seems different. Uh, should we go this way? Seems to be a dead end. Let's see if I'm right. Yeah. Hey, what are you? Energy cell. By collecting this item, Sherry can increase our total amount of energy. Energy is used to manage equipped components only at Denzel Station. An energy membrane with gelatinous consistency, this organic material is used to power atomic batteries. The higher the temperature of the membrane, the more energy can be consumed. Maybe next time we're at a Denzel station, we can look at that. down here. When we're in the battle, it's a little bit easier for some reason to organically just do the parry. Close. Denzel Factory. Oh shit, okay. We're, we're not done yet. I just got a checkpoint.
Move, keep moving. Damn, dude, this is kind of hard. This thing's hurt like a motherfucker. Jesus. So this soft stems, a thin long apparatus filled with atomic receptors. The control over electricity is astonishing. The pulsating life of the industry is a wheel that has no brakes. If it stopped, the entire planet would implode on itself. Word. Alright, um... Yeah, we can't go back that way. All right. Damn it, I thought we were getting close, but maybe not. How is it? Still got time. Shortcut. Good. Maybe we're going to get like a jump ability, like a double jump ability. And then we'll get that and then we can go up there and get the item. Maybe that's what it is. Why are they called Denzels? Are they gonna explain that at any point? The juggle ability seems to do pr a pretty good job of interrupting their attacks. To keep them from hitting me while I'm trying to combo. It keeps them from attacking.
Wait a minute. You're telling me I can't get to any of those up high places? Yeah, we're gonna get some kind of ability in here. And then when we're on our way back out, we're gonna be able to get, like, up there. I bet. That's my guess. Watch. I've played a fair few Metroidvanias at this point, although I had never played a Metroidvania when I started doing this in 2020. My first Metroidvania was Symphony of the Night, and uh, I've played probably... probably a dozen since. There's a lot I haven't played. But I've played most of the big ones at this point. Hollow Knight, Ori, Symphony of the Night. Uh, I haven't played any of the Metroid games. I tried the first Metroid game, and I fucking hated it. But I need to I need to try Super Metroid at some point. One of these days I will. Rip. Where are we going here? I bet you we're close. I have a feeling we're close. This might be even the final room. I just have a feeling, just the way that it's designed. Noble President, a threatening message reached us this morning. We now share with you the words of our enemies. There is no hatred and justice. There is no suffering in the blood of the purified enemy. A soul does not belong to anyone, not even to the body that contains it. We will come to take your head, and finally you will be free. The Drifters. The sender of the above message is now under interrogation. Very soon we will know from which sec sector these terrorists occupy. The enemy's forces are clearly inferior to us. All the leading attacks have been repelled with extreme ease. Your strength accompanies us all, noble president. At always faithful, Tiberius Nieson, head of security. Week 45, year 212. Mask. What's that? Broken tribal mask from a distant sector. The Metro structure is a mysterious place among its most remote ravines or forgotten civilizations and unknown creatures. This mask bears the marks of a peculiar craftsmanship. It's impossible to deduce its origin. God damn it! Come on, Nick. You almost got him. Are they regenerating or something? Fuck me!
I'm gonna learn how to fight these motherfuckers. Do better, Nick. I'm gonna fight you bastards again. You gotta nail those finisher attacks. If you don't, you're wasting a lot of healing potential and attack potential. These motherfuckers hit hard. Ah, fuck you! That was a different animation when I died. I hadn't seen that one yet. This is a tough mat fight to have to deal with right before walking into that other room. Alright. You can juggle those things too. That's good to know. I haven't tried that yet. Damage so fast. Oh, no, there's this many more. I can handle these guys, though. This is all right. Take care of him, and then you, you've got the rest of him. We're getting a little bit better. Jesus, dude. Now is not the time for you to be missing parries, Nick.
trying to figure out this fucking parry system. Do I go right when the light flashes, or... Is there anything in the... Like in the... Control? No. No. It's right as they're attacking. So for, ignore the blue light. The blue light is a... Is a distraction. Just forget about the blue light. Just watch their attack. Yeah. I'm still not sure I've quite figured it out, but that seems to be the basic gist of it. Thought I saw that wall move. Oh fuck, that hurt bad. Don't do that again, Nick. Awakened Denzel. Before this life, I worked down in the crystal pits digging up electro titanium. My hands were all bloodied and sore from all that labor. Couldn't even afford a decent meal. Now that I have a second chance at life, I refuse to be a slave. Althea. Oh, my dear sister, you have finally made it home. Me? Home? Who the heck are you? Forgive me, my name is Althea. I am an oracle for all Denzel. I can help you. Would you like to know who you were in your previous existence? Uh, sure. Really? You can do that? Yeah, tell me. Cherry, be realistic. The approach used by this artificial intelligence has no basis in science. I don't think you should believe her. Logic is so limited in its use, my small friend. Sometimes observing is not ju is just not enough. We need to feel in order to know. This is not possible. What is impossible? What are you seeing? Please. I'm afraid I won't be able to provide the answers you seek. The life energy that lies within you is, shall we say, beyond my understanding. What the hell is that supposed to mean? Do you know who I am or not? I told you, Cherry, you're wasting our time here. I've never seen anything like it. This power of yours, it's dangerous. It can lead you to greatness, but it can also bring pain and sorrow to your life. You will need to use it wisely. So that's it? You can't tell me anything else? Pfft, forget I asked, lady. Well, only you have the freedom to decide who you truly are. This is what matters. But allow me to offer this. There is more to achieve in life than simply taking care of the ones we love. I guess. Oh, my dear sister, I can feel the oppressive weight you carry. It is clear to me that your mission is very dangerous. Allow me to help you on your journey. I have a gift for you. It's on the other side of the door behind me. I very much hope this will lighten your load. Oh, I'm not sure I trust you, lady. Hey, Cherry, right? Welcome to our community. When do you awaken? This can be very confusing, I know, but never believe you're less than anyone, any, everybody else. Uh, okay. Can I have that? Is the ability a double jump? It's a double jump. I guarantee it's a double jump. 
Look. I can't get out without it. It's definitely a double jump. Press X and Aaron Tara will perform one more jump before landing. Let's go. She can dunk. Use double jump. She can dunk. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I'm going to go back and get that item now. May your spirit run free towards our common fate. Have a gift. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I already got it. In my past life, my primary function was a delivery driver. I did that for 20 years. When the awakening happened, I realized I could choose a new path. What? What am I doing in this mechanical body? I don't feel any- What? What am I doing in this mechanical body? I don't feel anything. What kind of existence is this? Yeah, I don't know. You're asking me a lot of questions. I don't know the answers to, my friend. We need to stay in hiding. Awakened beings like us are always considered anomalies. If they find out, they'll tear us apart. Okay, so now... There's this whole set of stuff in this area that I can go get now. I want to go get it now. Should I go get it now? Let's go get it. Page 1. Oswald Sandberg. Personal Journey. Uh, personal Journal. Year 210. Week 11. My dear Orietta, today's my third day here at the Solarium. Finally found the courage to rationalize the incredible quirks I've seen. This process of relocating the souls of the dead into the mechanical bodies is something so incredible and fascinating. I wish Adam could see where I'm working. I hope one day he'll be proud of me. What a strange thing is death. I didn't think it was so easy to defeat. Okay, so where does this spit me out? Okay, so... Uh, let's see what this is first. Page 2, Oswald Sandberg, Personal Journey, Journal, Year 210, Week 13. My dear Orietta, today is my 10th day here at the Solarium. I hope Adam is growing strong and healthy. I would love to hug him. I know that we have only believed, ever believed in the rationality of science and the good faith of the noble president, but I'm starting to feel there's something more behind the origin of life. What is happening here is puzzling. The only reason to work in the middle of this purgatory is to assure us the right to live in the Golden City. I will ask my superiors to give me a different role in this factory. I need to get out of this department. Yeah, now I want to do that thing that I want that people want to do in Metroidvanias, where it's like, okay, well now we need to go just find, go through all the parts of the map that we've already been through and find all the things that we couldn't access before, you know? all this? Where are we going right now? Whoops. Dum dum. I should just wait for them to walk off. Oh, fuck me. That is a clear, we can't go up there. We definitely can't go up there. Okay, and that's fine. Probably good. Ooh, Nick, careful.
I wonder if those are going to roast them too. That's some kind of ability we don't have yet for sure. Oh, this is going to take us back to the beginning, right? Probably. Or maybe not. Find the hidden Shodo statue? Uh, that looks like a man with a dick for a head. What am I looking at here? Gross. That whole situation is gross. Double tap. This component has been designed to increase the range of attacks of a Denzel. Allows Cherry to perform a second uppercut in the air during a multi-combo and multi-hit combo after a successful ground uppercut. Second uppercut in the air during a during a multi-hit combo after a successful ground uppercut. That sounds pretty good. That sounds like I could use that. I'm using that combo a lot. But I have to equip it. I'm enjoying this game so far, for sure. Um, right now the combat's a little cumbersome, but that's kind of to be expected. Because we don't have like all the abilities yet and everything. You know?
I don't think we know what that does yet. We certainly don't know what that does yet. Page three, Oswald Sandberg, Personal Journal, two, year 211, week 15. My dear Orietta, today I've completed my first month here at the Solarium. While I was polishing some silos, my attention was captured by a shrill sound. It was the voice of a captive soul begging me to free her. In a desperate cry for help, hearing it, I understood her fear of being condemned to eternal slavery. This is what awaits me after I die. Maybe I should try to fight her. Maybe I should try to sabotage the factory. No way, I've got no choice to, chance to do this alone. Okay, there's something up here. Aha! An energy cell. Let's fucking go. This area is pretty fucking big, man. a shortcut back. Yeah. Alright. Eventually we're gonna need to go and see what, what's waiting for us in that other area. In the I'm assuming there's a boss fight there. Shit, okay. first.
fuck am I going, man? Can I teleport from these? No. Yeah, these are something that you can, like, hitch a ride up on or something. I've seen those in so many Metroidvanias now. I know exactly what that shit is. So is this the back way into this fucking place? Oh, there was a boss that's a- that's warning me of a boss fight, I'm sure of it. Oh, Jesus, okay. Alright. Pissed off Mudbot? Oh, he's kicking my fucking ass. Oh, that was embarrassing. I like that load time, though. Um, so is it the case that I would have had to come this way no matter what? Is that what I'm learning now? Is that what I'm coming to find out? Uh... I mean, this guy's roasting me. I think you just have to fucking tank him. I almost had him. And I missed him with one of my most powerful attacks. So, let's try again. Dude, can you fucking sit still for a second? Motherfucker! That's a PB, but shit. I mean, there doesn't appear to be any way to... Can I dodge through his attacks, maybe? Or... Yes, I can. That's what it is. You gotta dodge through his attacks. That's much easier. Ah, fucking hit me with one of them. Let's go! Pissed off Mudbot, get wrecked. That was good, I like that fight. Taught me how to play a little bit better. Those are my favorites. It was quick, and hectic, but it's fun. LED visor. Artificial visual apparatus. This lost package seems to be destined to locate some to someone located inside seem to be destined to someone located inside Bloody Den area. The LED visor is able to restore sight to people who are blind. Excessive use of LED visor may cause hallucinations. Okay, so that's a quest item, it seems like. Okay, is that it's, I can't use that, can I? Destined to someone located inside Bloody Den area. Blue Tentacle. Soul Flask. Orb Tissue. And Toxic Waste.
Yeah, I gotta go with that. Um. Alright. So I, I guess I came the right way. I wasn't expecting that to be the case, but I did eventually. I just kind of stumbled into the right way to go. Oh shit! Oh no! Oh, oh, I made a stupid mistake. I thought that was a platform. It was just a wall. Oh, okay. Well, there's a checkpoint in the room, so we're good. Oh, we're getting that item over there. No doubt about it. Soul Flask. Pace 5. Oswald Sandberg, Personal Junior jur Journal, Year 211, Week 25. My dear Orietta, I hope some miracle will allow you to read these words. My time in this factory is becoming more and more unbearable. Infonets, infonets, madness is piercing my brain. I'm afraid I won't be able to save myself. My superiors observe my behavior. Surely they understand my hostility and see me as a subversive individual. I know they're planning my suppression. I need to make sure that when I'm gone, you and your beloved Adam can see, save yourselves from this. You must escape the Golden City as soon as possible. Find a way to reach the underground sectors and take shelter with the rebel communities that live there, so your soul will not be content, condemned to slavery. Please do not worry about me, for it is certain that even after death and during perpetual bondage, my soul will be sustained by the thought of your love. I promise that you that I will do everything I can to see you again, whether in this night, le life or the next. Okay. Sucks to suck. Um, I'm still interested in seeing what else is in this location. Should I do that now? I, that appears to be the item that we... Bring the eye visor to its owner. Yeah. So, so we're done in the Denzel factory, except we, uh, could get all these items, and we will, I think. Or we'll at least try to get some of them. Um, I wish we could teleport literally any of these places. So we can't get into that area. But there's a lot of areas we can get into. We did, we did all this above us. We did all that. Yeah, I thought I was supposed to come up here. That ends up mm, looking like it's not the case. through this area. Excuse me. <coughs> oh, I didn't mute that one. Whoops. Excuse me.
Okay, yeah, I want to see what's up here. Oh, it's just that. Okay. Okay. Then there's all this stuff over here. Could probably go all the way around and then teleport. Think about it. Um, let's go quickly, though. Let's not kill every enemy or any of that stuff. We are just trying to get the items. And it's already been almost two hours. Yeah, I couldn't get up here before. Ah, you fucking rash heap. Alright, it's fine. Careful, Nick. It takes a long time to kill regular enemies. That's my one complaint so far. But I... That seems to be just because I don't have a lot of abilities yet, so... Ah, you fucking clown, Nick. Come on, bro. This is. Yeah, we can't really fast travel out of here, so. Oh, damn it, I didn't realize you could hit me. Fuck you, you bastard.
Alright, let's see what this is. I've been ho I've been hoping this whole time to find things that will extend my life bar. I haven't found anything like that yet. In games like Ori and Hollow Knight, those things are just kind of around. <sighs> All right, um, it's okay. All right, so here's where we got the double jump. So we went through all of this. So let's just go back up the way we came and... Or should we teleport? Nah, let's go. Let's go back. Let me go back. I just want to see what else... I, I won't be this thorough for the whole game, definitely not, but I'll, sometimes when I first start a game, if I'm enjoying it enough, I will be quite thorough. And this seems like an area we maybe won't ever have to come back to, and so if that's the case especially, I'd like to really cross it off the list, you know? See if we can get up there. Nice. Okay, be careful, Nick. Don't double jump into the ceiling, bro. Another energy cell. Oh, we should have equipped those motherfuckers when we were at the thing. Let's go look at that. I forgot about that. Yeah, it's right here. We've got three energy cells now. Oh, we've got five, I guess. Okay, so now we've got this equipped. I'll have to see it in action. It doesn't look like it's just gonna work in the air. I'm gonna have to actually tr test it on an enemy. Do it here, though. Okay, what else is up here? way out?
loading screen. Discover the Numa chambers chambers. Is this a whole area? Looks like it might be a whole area. We'll know as soon as we start seeing regular enemies. No regular enemies yet. Oh. Okay, we can't... We can't do anything here yet. This is way back out later, it looks like. Oh, damn it. I was thinking maybe I could get under it if I... I didn't realize the bars came down. Okay. Go, go, go. Oh, yeah, let's figure out what that other thing is. We don't know what that is, I guess, and we still can't interact with it even though we can hit it now. Fine. Oh yeah. Can we do that thing? Yes, you can. You can do double double uppercut juggles. Like that. Fan of that. Why is this thing still on the... Why is it still on the map when I've already gotten it? I don't care for that.
think we're done here. There is something up there. So there must be a triple jump or some kind of other mechanic that will get me up really high. Because um, there ain't no way I'm reaching that right now. What do I spin these things on again? Oh, I can't get out from here? Oh, you're kidding me. You're kidding me. Oh, yeah, you are kidding me. Okay. I was gonna have to go back all the way down and fucking teleport. No, we're good. All right, cool. Oh yeah, we can get to this now. What's up here? Absolutely nothing. Are these gonna be like people I meet along the way that can help me in certain ways after I've unlocked them or something, maybe? Ooh, that's close. You sure I can't get that? No. So we still can't get quite up all the way up there. Wait a moment now. Advanced wiring. did it. Let's go ahead and stop. And we will go to this area next. Yeah, let's just stop here. What else can I, like... Can you, like, do any other upgrades or anything for These me? Are Shinji's logs. <laughs> oh, we know about that already. Buy upgrade gears. HP enhancer. This component is a very popular product in the robotics engines. In, uh, it, it adds health, correct? Increases the performance of the synthetic leg muscle products and increasing the power with which kicks are thrown. I want both of those. Oh, and to upgrade it, we need Korg Tissue. And Slimy Bone. Alright. Required Energy 2. Okay, so that needs a lot. Adds 25 HP. Increases damage. Cherry inflicts with basic attacks. Okay. 
Okay, alright. So, I didn't realize that you, they were, had different energy requirements. That's okay. Actually, you know, I think... No, nah, I'll take the health. I'll take the health. That's a big jump. You know what, actually, though? I think I want to take this out. Put this in. Yeah, there we go. Alright. I hate it when it says that, but then it doesn't tell me... ...when the last time I saved is. Come on, man. Part. What the fuck, dude? Oh, for Christ's sake! Are you serious? Oh, right. You have to save at the save point. <laughs> Alright, whatever. Oh, we have to do all that bullshit that we just did again. Alright, well, let's do it quickly. Fuck me. I just need to map it so that I know that I've been here. Can't quite make that. That's okay. Wait, so I do have the upgrades? No, 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 I don't want to talk. God damn it. I hit down once, not twice. So I have them, but they're not equipped? Excuse me? All I had to do was fucking walk into this goddamn thing. That's all I had to fucking do. And now I've fucking broken the game? You have got to be fucking kidding me. Oh, that is fucking awful. That is fucking so awful. Are you serious? I don't have the upgrades and they're not available for purchase. I broke the fucking game. load. Oh my fucking god. I don't care about talking to him. Okay. Okay. I'll look into it later. Maybe they'll patch it out tomorrow. Fuck me. I'll figure it out later. All right. That, this has been an awesome experience until about 30 seconds ago. I hope I can figure out some kind of a way around that, because I really wanted both of those fucking abilities. And my currency's gone. Wait. No, it isn't. I still have my currency. 
Oh, for fuck's sake. I'll figure it out later.